Doris Riboli, and welcome to the Riboli Center. I'd like to invite you to come to see the current exhibit that we've got, Shifting Gears. It will be on until July 18th. It features some amazing paintings by wonderful artists. We have a painting by Joe Riboli. We have several paintings by Alan Bull, Scott Hewitt, Doug Rayner, Jim Loy, and Nelson Medina. And I want to thank Nelson particularly because he's really been very helpful in putting this exhibit together. He was very good friends, or is very good friends, with Marshall Buck. Marshall Buck is a model maker. He makes all of these things from scratch. He's also the editor of this magazine, Automobilia, which is available here for free when you come in. Uh, he also is very good friends with a fascinating man named Peter Nedersheim. Peter Nedersheim has a Nedersheim Museum in Huntington that's all about motorcycles, in particular BMW. He has a collection of over 130 motorcycles and he's led us far two of these 1928 motorcycles, one that's been completely uh, restored and one that's completely unrestored. And it's just, uh, everybody is thrilled with this exhibit. He was also very good friends with Howard Koplick. Howard Koplick is a historian who specializes in the Vanderbilt Road Parkway. So in our history room, we've got a wonderful exhibit. So I hope that you will stop in. We've still got four weeks left. We hope that you will stop in and see this exhibit. The paintings are for sale. Many of the models are for sale as well. So please come in and visit us. The other thing I wanted to talk to you about today is that the Gaboli Center is always looking for really unusual, well-made crafts. And um, one of the people that I'm very excited to talk to you about tonight is a woman named Janet Zug. When I came across the work of Janet Zug, I was so impressed. And uh, I think she's been very popular with everyone who's come in. Uh, these are her beautifully hand-blown glass pieces. She's from Vermont, and we're very thankful that she was willing to uh, send some of her pieces this far away from her home. Uh, we're going to show you a video today about how she makes one of these vases, and it really is really fascinating. So I hope you'll enjoy that. And uh, before we show you that video, I just wanted to thank a few people. I uh, would like to thank Suffolk County for their grants, uh, in particular Kara Hahn, who's made that a possibility. We want to thank um, Nelson Medina for bringing in all these wonderful people. I uh, would like to thank our sponsor, which is Plycar, who's been very generous with us. And we also wanted to thank uh, Andy at Display Makers because he's been just a wonderful friend to the gallery for many years, and we're very grateful. Uh, just also thank you to all the other people that have given us donations over time. I can't tell you how much your donations have meant to us. It's uh, not only encouraging, but it also helps us keep the doors open. So enjoy the video, and uh, we hope to see you here.
Thank <laughs> you.